Here's a spin video for a black Timascus over Timascus top that I just made. It has a little second half flutter, so doing the video. You can see that was a pretty moderate spin to get it going. And obviously not the best spin technique as I have it fooling. So this top has um, an eighth inch ceramic ball. It's got a big core, um, so that's you know somewhere around about a half inch piece of Timascus that I push uh, into um, a black Timascus disc and then finish it all as one assembly. And then I part it off, polish it, and then do the heat coloring steps. Um, on the, on the core, right before it necks down to the stem, um, I put some nice texturing. So you can see sort of texture over, um, the Timask, or, you know, over the Timascus, and it has a really nice effect, um, when colored. And you'll see that in the photos that I post. Um, you can see here, it's go gone about minute 45. And it's kind of settling in now um, off of that bad bad start, I guess, that bad spin technique that I started with. Um, and here, it's got a tiny little bit of flutter at this point, two minutes in. Um, you can sort of, can sort of see that in, in the way that light's reflecting off the top. Um, let me zoom back in and see how it does for autofocusing. Let me actually bring the tripod down a little and see if that does a little better. Okay, that focus looks a little bit cleaner. Um, and in the video, you can sort of see it doing a flutter thing. Um, I think it actually looks like a little less flutter in the video than I feel like I'm seeing in person. Um, and, you know, in the previous video with the two tungsten ones, um, there were times that it looked like more because of the optical illusion and looked like less. And again, you can kind of see the optical illusion. It looks as if the top is spinning counterclockwise when in fact it's spinning clockwise. So now you can kind of see how that shake is picked up. Um, and, you know, the amplitude of the shake is actually moderately large it's you know not a super well behaved top um, but it is kind of neat watching something with um the different you know timascus lines kind of fluttering away not that it's awesome or anything but it does have a nice effect and it is a beautiful top And then also on this top, um, whoever ends up getting it, I've got this cool plastic um, with blue in it. 
Oh, there we go. It's starting to click. So I've got this um, clear plastic stand for it that has some blue in it. Um, so it creates kind of a nice effect. So you can see it still, it, it clattered against the lens so I stopped the uh, timer. But it's actually still going. Um, it's sort of ironically clackering against the lens got it I guess a little bit restabilized. Um, so it's still spinning um, and it actually has it's not s s stable but it has settled down some as the amount of energy it has reduces. And there now it's come to a full stop. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will also post pictures to go with this. Thanks.